I will demonstrate the steps required for building a library that can be used with BASIC for Android. I'm starting with Eclipse and I'm going to create a new project. We need to choose Java project, it is not uh, an Android project. The next step is to reference the required libraries. First I'm going to add android.jar which is part of the Android SDK. And we also need to add the two libraries that are part of uh, BASIC for Android. You will usually find it under program files. We are adding before a shared and core. Okay, so now we are going to write some Java code, the library code. So, new class. We need to add the short name annotation to this class. We will create a simple method. We can add regular Java docs to document our uh, new method. In order to generate the, the required XML file, we need to configure and use a special uh, Docklet tool. You can download this Docklet from the forum. So we have a folder with uh, these two files. I'm copying the path. and I'm going to choose Generate Javadoc. You should enter BA Doclet as the Doclet name and in the path I'm pas pasting the previously copied path. We need to set the output file for the generated XML.
the result is that we have one uh, jar file and uh, and the second file is the XML file. Now we need to copy these files to the to the to basic for Android uh, additional libraries path or to the internal libraries. So I have opened basic for Android and I'm going to the libs tab. I'm right clicking and choose uh, and I will choose refresh and here is uh, our library. Note that it is very important to choose refresh even if uh, the library already appears otherwise you, you will use a cached version of uh, the library when you first run your program. check the logs and see that it is working.